Let me know if there's anything I can do to lighten the load. Or, you know... Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are back on Fallout 4 uh, playing the Automatron DLC. I'm going to quick, we're going to go ahead and do Ada, see what we can get uh, on her. So we could change her head, but I like her head now and I don't... Oh, she's got some, uh, she's got already a head factory armor. We could get head factory hardened armor. This place sure took a beating. Let's go ahead and grab that. Let's go ahead and get Ada all upgraded here. Torso. We want the Assaultron torso, I think. I like that. She's got the best armor already there and there. Hacking module. Adds lock picking subroutine. Wow. I need better robotics expert. Hold on. It's always We got a level up. So let's go find Robotics Expert. Where is that under? It's something that I have nothing in yet. Here we go, Robotics Expert. Let's go ahead and put into that. Alright, so we were on Torso, right? Re recon tracks targets, deals radiation damage, stealth field. I like that. I like the, uh, the Tesla coil. That sounds pretty great. Wow, that is really good. I need Robotics Expert too, so we're going to wait on doing anything there. Left arm. We're going to stick with the Assault. Um, she's got the left arm factory armor. Okay, here we go. So we could get a baton, a vice grip, a flamer, a laser, a stun mod, a hook, a mace, an axe, Another different type of laser, a cryo. Oh my gosh! Automatic laser, left hand hammer. She has the left hand claw right now. Construction claw. Oh my gosh! Fall or uh, the Bioshock. I gotta get this. I think I'm gonna put it in the right hand, but I gotta get that. The saw blade, nail. Oh my god, a nail gun. Left hand automatic laser, scat sniper laser, left handed shish kebab, late, oh my god, a laser gat, we're getting the laser gatling as right now, holy explosive minigun, oh my god, explode causing area effect, unstable may break when used, may, may break, are you, are you kidding me game? You're going to ruin the fun that this could be with your logic of being able to break stuff? Fine. We will go... I don't know what I want. I almost want to go with the nail gun just because it sounds fun. We're going nail gun. Let me get the... I already know I'm putting... Wait, a sentry right arm? Most folks are just looking for a hand. What does the sentry arm do for me? What is happening? Dude, my thing is like glitched out now. Hold on. What is happening? That was weird. What is happening with my there we go. Exceptional carrying capacity, improved melee damage on the sentry. Superior carrying capacity, reduced melee da Reduced? Why would I want reduced melee damage? Give me... Give me my Bioshock. Give me my big daddy from Bioshock. Where is it? Well, that hammer is kind of awesome. Yeah, give me that drill. Gimme that drill. Maybe constantly trying to kill us, but the Commonwealth never lacks for excitement. I, I don't I don't exactly get the reduced melee damage option. It doesn't really make any sense to me. Where what gun do we want on this thing? The cryo jet seems extremely awesome. 
automatic laser seems pretty awesome, too. What's the difference between left hand Protectron left hand automatic laser and just an automatic laser? The, the Gatling just looks so awesome. I guess for now we'll just go with the automatic light. Gosh, that takes so many supplies. It's a good thing I have a ridiculously crazy amount of supplies. No way! No way, we're going with the thruster. No way, I did not know that that was going to be a thing. Yep, we're getting her the, the good armor. The goods. Alright, now paint. She's got some aqua paint going on now. Ooh, -hoo -hoo, the black paint looks pretty cool. Blue paint, I like the blue paint. Mm, dark gray, dark green, gray. God, the colors. Red paint, white paint. Let's go white paint for now. Dude, this is awesome. Look at Ada. That is freaking epic. Now I'm wondering... I also put this here. It's going to be my way up for now. I don't know. I'll probably, I need to find a better way to construct it, but... Let me see. Let me actually store that. But we do have a way up here now to our awesome robot building epicness up here. So let's go ahead. We need to investigate General Atomics. That is right down here. I've already discovered it, so we can fast travel right to it. Let me open up my... My sparkling mango water. Orange mango water. This stuff is is decent, but it's healthy, zero calories and all that junk. If I had my choice, I'd be drinking a sun kissed about now, but trying to get a little bit more a little bit more healthy. Uh, been kind of out of commission with this stupid foot, so I need to kind of get back into shape. Um, and I need to, uh, I don't know, I need to start eating a little bit more healthier than I have. Not that I eat bad or anything or that, like I'm fat, but I just need to start start eating better and stop drinking as much pop as I usually do. Why is my, like, sprint button broke? There we go. And so drinking this Kirkland sparkling zero calorie orange mango water it kind of satis it doesn't really satisfy but it, it's supposed to satisfy my need for pop uh even i love pop i don't know why um but it, it pop is like one can a day you know is fine um i really need to get into the habit of drinking coffee because i have a i have like a pop every morning uh and i, I usually only want to have one pop a day so by the time i have one in the morning when i wake up there's my pop for the day. Alright, we're just in here. Oh, Ada's epic! I'm getting... I am getting... I am getting... New, oh my god, I just got reamed! Holy, I'm level 51! I didn't think I'd die that quick! Holy crap! I just got wrecked. I wasn't even paying attention to my health. I need to hotkey my stim packs. But that, that was pathetic. I, I didn't... I didn't think I would get wrecked that quick. I forgot my power armor too, but... Look at how many stem bags I have. Oh, that's so stupid. Spray. Dude, what do I want to get rid of? Let me get rid of the sniper for it. I don't even know what difficulty I'm playing on right now, but I don't know. Whatever they just did to me right there, they completely wrecked me. Oh, God, there's one behind me. Jab the stem pack in. That's Ada. Robo brain torso. Okay, I need to just keep picking stuff up because I think every like new piece of 
armor that you or new piece of uh, robot that you find. Oh my gosh, a legendary cryo mech swarm bot. Hey Ava, you want to help me kill this thing? Why can I not? This little shit. He's a little pussy. Huh? What's this? I don't know, because I can't get into it. Um... Oh, what is down here now? Integrated junk bot. Oh my gosh, new mods are just going to be continually added. This is going to be... Kill the legendary! I'm interested to see what the legendary is gonna get me. Alright, novice hacking good. Should be able to get this bad boy. Let's try drag. Nothing. Shut. One. Now oh, this isn't gonna work. Skin. Nope. What the hell is- oh my god, I'm about to die. I'm about to die. What on earth just happened? There we go. Okay, let me do the stupid things so I can eliminate some of the bad options. Uh, is there anything else here? Like, what the heck? Usually the novice ones give you a ton. Okay. Trek. Thus. Cops. Okay. Door open. Did that open this door by any chance? Nope. Alright. Ooh. Some good stuff there. I want to keep looking and everything because... I'm not sure if there's any new items or any new s things here. Okay, there's something over there. I don't think I ever came to this area like I discovered it. But I don't think I ever, like, came in here. Saltron front actuated frame. Holy, this is crazy. There's just going to be a bunch of different mods and stuff everywhere. You douchebag. I'm trying to find that legendary. I gotta find him. If I do nothing else in this episode, we gotta find that legendary and see what he drops. Nice. If he drops something DLC related, that is gonna be crazy. That I got a DLC legendary so quick. The only thing is, how am I supposed to know? Like, I don't have every legendary weapon in the game. So there's no way for me to tell, really. Probably would have helped if I would have cleared out this area before. Because I think I am finding a lot of stuff that is not related to the DLC. Now where... Okay, I don't want to go over there yet. Where is this SOB? Ah, oh, here we go. Ghoul... No, you didn't give me. Ghoul Slayer's left leather left leg. Dang it, dude. I wanted a DLC, something. I got, I got cheated. Oh, you think? How are they hitting me and I can't hit them through the wall? That is some bullshit. Okay, let me get this open. Security door control. Oh, okay, there's not even like a... We're just rocking and rolling. A quantum robe... something. Quantum robo-brain. Ooh, mechanist device. There we go. What 
Wait, what are we doing? Oh, I gotta talk hey. to her. Yes, ma'am. Hey, Ada. Did you retrieve something from that robot? It had this strange device on it. Let's have a look. Impressive technology. If my analysis is correct, this is a specialized radar beacon. I suspect it's how the mechanist was keeping track of the robo brain you destroyed. As the next logical step, I need you to install this beacon within me so we can use it to our advantage. Let's just hope it's safe. I share your sentiment. You'll need to use a robot workbench to ensure proper installation, and my presence will be required. To maintain peak efficiency, I strongly recommend that we remain together until the radar beacon is successfully installed. Dude, she just looks so epic. This is amazing. Oh, look at all of this. Dude, this is crazy. I'm gonna have so much fun modding out, or not modding out, but messing with different robot combinations and stuff like that. That's crazy. I'm just gonna have robot on robot on robot roaming around my base. It's gonna be epic. I think I might create, like, Sweet. a new base just for, uh... There, there's like a beach area. I might do that and just have robot heaven there and just keep like editing robots and stuff like that. What am I doing? How do I get out of here? What is my quest right now? Sp I did speak to Ada. Hey. Hey. Heads what up. the heck? What can I do for you? Are you ready to install the radar beacon? It's time. Let's do this. Good. The installation should be simple. Once I'm in the robot workbench, just install the radar beacon and I'll do the rest. Oh, okay. What the heck? I had that dialogue already, game. So I need to s install the beacon into Ava. Okay, that's good, because now I can grab my power armor that I forgot. Like an idiot. The robot workbench allows for the construction of a wide range of robots, including combinations never approved by General Atomics International or RoboCo. Or Ro Robeco. Not with RoboCo, but Robeco is kind of is all right. There are a variety of you know, that's not related to the DLC. This thing is awesome. I, I have some plans on what I can what I can do base wise. Maybe we'll do some base building with. After this DLC is complete, um, just doing like a robot base, um, and then we'll await the next DLC. Um, but this is kind of this is something that could really get me back into playing this game a lot. Let me go ahead and use a rataway. I don't have that many rataways. Okay, we gotta go back here. Did my game freeze? Did my game just... No, okay, we're good. We're good. thought my game froze. Oh, Fallout. You and your loading times, just like every other good Xbox One game and PS4 game, has these epic proportion loading times. Like, this almost makes me want to completely switch to PC. Like, why do I? Speed up your crap. Nothing will be worse than The Witcher and Bloodborne. Nothing. They're, 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 it doesn't get much worse than those two games. Mostly because of Bloodborne, you die so much, you gotta sit through those loading to screens every time. And Witcher was just horrible because it literally took like three minutes to load in The Witcher. It was crazy. The Witcher, nothing will be worse than The Witcher's loading times. But The Witcher, what it lacked in loading screens, it uh, made up in gameplay i still love the witcher um i'll be doing a like full on full blown playthrough of that probably uh during the summer granted no good games come out or anything we'll do a full blown witcher playthrough all right let's head back up top though Identity confirmed. we got automatron 855 down here just chilling i'm assuming you can rename it we've got kate here hanging out we got Piper. It's just a, it's just a party at my in my mansion. 
I could make Kiri a human. That would probably have been a smart idea to do. Okay, let me go ahead and store some of my crap. So we've got all of this junk that I need to store. Got this junk. I really need to store these somewhere so I can just store all my junk. Okay. Ada. Special mods. Radar beacon. It's always fascinating watching you create. Heads up. Look I think Ada, Ada is my new favorite. A moment. The modification was successful. New hardware has been detected and software is updating. And installation complete. Analyzing mechanist hardware. The radar beacon is receiving a strong encrypted signal, but I can't determine the source. It's a good start, at least. Absolutely. With some additional assistance, I should be able to decrypt the signal and locate the mechanist. Fortunately, I'm detecting another robo-brain in the Commonwealth that's receiving the same signal. Finally, we have an advantage. Perhaps, but it isn't quite that simple. The encryption on the source signal is complex, but not beyond solving. If you can bring me two additional beacons, they should provide the keys and algorithms that I need to enhance my decryption routines. Um... All right. Okay. Let's do it. I'm uploading the location of the Robo Brain to your Pip Boy now. Just be careful. These robots tend to travel in groups, so you're likely to encounter heavy resistance. Okay, a new threat completed. Um, I need I to. Place this vast was essentially a glorified bus terminal. Okay, let me hop in my power armor. This is first and foremost. So we need to collect a second radar, radar beacon now. Um, I'm going to go ahead and we need to store these weapons I've got because... Just need a full bottle and some bones to break. Need to do some storing of different stuff. Here we go. Here we go, this is where I've been storing junk. That, that can go in there. So can that. These can go in there. Okay. Now. I made it to here, now I gotta let my th <laughs> This is the one great thing about the, the uh, jetpack. It's being able to get where you need to go without having to mess with- Oh, I done goofed it up. Son of a bitch. Well, it doesn't help you too much when you mess up. And then this side over here is a little glitch. Okay. I think this is where I put my unique armor pieces. Or most of them. So we can do that. And now let's put away our weapon. I don't need the sniper anymore. Also don't need the grenades anymore in my inventory. Just trying to keep a nice concise inventory um, because this is going to get a little bit um, inventory heavy I have a feeling with picking up all these mods and different things that we can find on all of these robots. But that is going to do it for this episode, guys. In the next one, we will go out and get the second beacon, the uh, second radar beacon, which is... Let's take a look at where it is. I don't even see the arrow on my map. Where? There we go. It's up. It is right here. So it is just north of Fort Hagen. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Drop a like if you did. You know, subscribe if you haven't. And I will catch you with the next part of uh, the Fallout 4 Automatron DLC. Uh, so peace out. I have extensive quarantine protocols for airports in case of outbreak. I think that information can be...